You're listening to Soap Dirt, the latest in television entertainment news. Hey there, Days of Our Lives fans. I have got your full roster of weekly spoilers for July 22nd through 26th. Alex Kiriakis is going to be absolutely disgusted and Xander Cook Kiriakis is going to be shocked. This is Belinda from Soap Dirt and we are going to dive right in. We are going to have the debut of Fiona Cook on Friday, July 19th. We're going to get a glimpse of her, but everything is really going to ramp up with the action starting on Monday, July 22nd, 2024, which is season 59, episode 236. The crasher at the double wedding causes chaos. It looks like on Friday, one of the couples says I do and the other I do delays over onto Monday. We are going to get a whole lot of fun from Xander's mom, Fiona Cook, played by Serena Scott Thomas. Her arrival turns Alex Kidiakis' life upside down. On Monday, Teresa Donovan loses everything. Fiona is back to make amends to her son because he is a gazillionaire because he is Victor's heir. She's expecting to come back and see her son, you know, sitting on top of a pile of gold like Scrooge McDuck. And when she sees that Alex is the heir, she's going to expose all of that really quick because she's the one who wrote the letter, not Angelica Devereaux. And Teresa's about to be blown out of the water and exposed on Monday. Cannot wait for that. Meanwhile, while the disastrous double wedding is blowing up in Horton Town Square, and by the way, Lady Whistleblower is there. Leo's going to be so happy that he took Bonnie's invitation to show up. He's going to have a lot to write about. So at the same time, we're going to have Brady Black sitting with Ava Vitale, and they are commiserating about their breakups. Harris Michaels walked out on her. He is off doing whatnot. The bottom line is Steve Burton left. He only did one year on the soap. And Brady has lost Teresa. He was just thinking about her, even though he knows how toxic they are together. I don't know if he's going to drink that vodka, maybe. But Brady, I think, is up for making some bad decisions, perhaps with Ava. We'll see. We'll see. He does like like to make very bad choices with women, so she may be his next mistake. Tuesday, July 23rd, 2024, episode 237 of season 59. We've got Bobby, who's pretending to be Everett, having a very strange encounter with Jada Hunter. And of course, the problem is that Bobby's nature is so different from Everett's, and he's trying to pretend to be this mild-mannered guy, and he's crushing on Jada. You know, he broke up with Stephanie, basically told her he needed time to heal. He didn't need time to heal. It's Bobby who wants Jada back. But of course, Jada is also very worried about Rafe, who has been stabbed. And, you know, Stefan and Gabby make up after their argument. He was very upset that she told everybody, told the whole world that Stefan isn't the baby's dad. But she's not going to be too apologetic. She hates EJ and wanted it to come out. And I think things are going to go badly because Stefan's secret about Ava is going to come out soon. And I'm guessing EJ is the one who might expose it. Kristen puts Ava in an awkward position on Tuesday. Oh my goodness. Just by the way, if Ava does do the deed with Brady, you know, Kristen's going to lose it. And also on Tuesday, killer Connie Vanisky needs a new plan. So she thought that Bob Everett wanted her to kill Rafe, get him out of the way. That's what she thinks it meant. But she didn't stab him thoroughly enough. And so now I think she's going to try and kill him properly this time. Wednesday, July 24th, 2024, season 59, episode 238. Kate Roberts delivers some news to Abe, some good, some bad about their body and soul reboot plan. And Gabby finds Connie with Rafe. I wonder if she's going to be in there messing with his IV or putting a pillow over his face. I mean, honestly, I don't know if I'd miss Rafe that much, but (laughs) don't tell him I said that. Um, 
Bob Everett does something that makes Stephanie and Jada suspicious. It's raising some red flags. And then the way he's behaving with Kayla and Marlena raises even more red flags. I know a lot of people are on the fence about Blake Barris and this whole Bob Everett thing, but I'm enjoying him. I think he's a good actor. Thursday, July 25th, 2024 is episode 239 of the current season. And Holly gets some life changing news from her mother, Nicole. Nicole is planning on them all moving to Paris with Eric. She wants Holly and baby Jude and her and Eric to just leave town, get a fresh start. Holly doesn't want that. She and Tate have plans for the summer, they've been sneaking out. And she's just not interested in her mom's new plan. EJ faces off with Eric in a last ditch fight for Nicole. I mean, Nicole is totally over EJ. She is furious. But I did a video on this yesterday. You guys can check it out in the main page or on the day's playlist. EJ actually has a legal standing. He could temporarily delay their exit because he was married to Nicole when she gave birth and he's on the birth certificate for the kid. They would need to go to court to establish Eric's paternity if EJ won't willingly sign it over. So it's kind of interesting. Alex Kiriakis is very angry. He's very upset. He's very bitter about what Teresa did, not just because of uh, losing the inheritance. I think it's not even really about that. It's more about losing the good father that Justin was to him. But to me, that is largely, that's on Alex because he's the one who decided to treat Justin like crap because he found out somebody else was his biological dad. And I hope Justin makes him eat crow, but he probably won't because Justin's a nice guy. Sarah Horton tries to calm down Alex and his hurt feelings. Brady complicates his life and makes it so much messier. So I just wonder if he's going to get back in bed with Teresa, get in bed with Ava. We'll see. Xander wants answers from Teresa. I mean, the answer is she hates him. And so she decided to screw him over, but we'll see how that conversation goes. I'm sure it's not going to be pleasant. Friday, July 26, 2024, season 59, episode 240. We're going to end next week with Xander being very vulnerable. He's opening up to Maggie, talking to her about his and Victor's complicated relationship now that he knows Victor was his bio dad and just how much he always wanted his approval and just all the the hoops that Victor made him jump through and the the mean-spirited things he did to him. Alex and Brady get a surprise from Teresa. That should be interesting. I've heard that she is going to be leaving town under a cloud of shame, but we'll see. That's from my leaker, not an official spoiler yet. And Alex mends fences with Justin. That is long, long overdue. And Holly tells her mom, stop interfering in her life. She says she does not want to be uprooted to go out of town. And after this Friday, the 26th, there's only one episode left. Ari Zucker is done on July 29th. I do know that Ashley Pozemus, who plays Holly, is still shooting even now. So Holly stays behind. I have heard that she's going to be living with her grandma, Maggie. I don't know if she's going to leave temporarily with Nicole and then come back. Same thing with Greg Vaughn. He may leave short term with Nicole and then come back because he was filming through the end of April 2024, I believe, which puts him in episodes through like December or January. So we'll see. It's going to get very messy. Those are all of our weekly spoilers. Thanks for listening. Thank you for being a loyal listener. Follow us wherever you get your podcast because you don't want to miss the next episode. Soap Dirt is on all the major podcast platforms, including Apple Podcast, Spotify, iHeartRadio, and more. <laughs>